Welcome home, Bitcoin truth seekers. It is Thursday, January 14th at 7.44 a.m. here in the Arizona desert. As always, check out BitcoinDailyView.com. We've got more for you there. And of course, also there's a Telegram group. You can find it there, linked to at BitcoinDailyView.com. Come join the conversation, have some fun. We post stuff and talk crap all day. Bitcoin and the alt, and the alt market versus USDT. Looking wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. ADA is a big winner, continues to be. Polkadot, wow, XRP is still in the running. 30 cents now. Ethereum up 13%. Bitcoin up 14%. It is a glorious day. Polkadot, dot, also up 11% against Bitcoin. So, Bitcoin and the, of course, Bitcoin is the Bitcoin market. So, Bitcoin, of course, is gray here. But we can see all it's versus Bitcoin. It's an ass hammering day so far, except for Polkadot, which is unstoppable. All right. Bitcoin trading volume last 24 hours, 8.3 billion. That's rocking 4 billion of that on Binance and 1.5 billion on Coinbase. Rocking. No one else is breaking a billion, but still. Overall, this is amazing, amazing uh, volume. Even though it's gone down since we had some dumps earlier, it does not matter. This is wonderful. This is like volume like we've never seen. This is 2021 volume. A whole new ball game. Binance with the longs and shorts, I think, being the most because that's where the volume is. 64% longs, 35% shorts. That is rocking. So let's look at Bitcoin here on the daily. This is a big deal. Yesterday, we pulled out of our downtrend and got a beautiful green candle. Now we have another beautiful green candle starting right on the shoulders of the other one. That's really strong. Well above the 200 moving average, of course. And the MACD, we've got a slightly correcting histogram here. Look at that. We are moments, seconds, possibly it's even happened. We are about to cross positive on the MACD. This is glorious. And you can see it reflected in the charts. Now, the two hour chart for Bitcoin is a powerful, powerful thing. Before we look at that, um, let's look at the three day. All right. Now, uh, the last three day was uh, January 10th, 11th and 12th. This one is 13th, 14th and 15th. So glorious. We are we're in a nice beautiful green candle here. We're turning that around on the three day and the, and the MACD is now turned towards a positive histogram. It's widening the way we would like to see it. A quick look at the 12 hour. All right, green candles there. MACD about to turn positive on the 12 hour. That's really, really cool. Four hour. MACD has turned positive. Green histogram. This is glorious. And the two hour. All right, positive. So we've really gotten our uptrend back in action. The Lambo, the Bitcoin Lambo, has struck back with a vengeance. Now, a Fibonacci sequence fired off here, begun. Last time we crossed the 200 moving average on the uh, two hour chart. You go up to our recent all time high, which is nice now that we have one. Uh, that's this little bit of time we've had for this all to evolve really makes, uh, I think, a Fib mean more, okay? Um, when the top of your fib is where you're at, and that's the all-time high, it doesn't mean much. So from 200 moving average cross, upwards trend to the uh, all-time high recently, check it out. We had a perfect and classic perfection dot five fib bounce. That is glorious. This fib lines up at the chart just absolutely perfectly. Now we've gotten above that to the uh, 382, found some support, bounced off that. Now we just rocked the 236 and we're heading back. We got blue skies back to that all time high of 42,100 or so. So myself, I took a long out this morning and I'm rocking this up and boom, I'm going to hop out before. Actually, I think I already stopped out at around 39.5. I want to reevaluate the velocity when we hit 40K. All right. Now with that said, um, boom, looking at the 45 minute chart. This is really important for immediate price action. It tells you which way you're going. 45 minute chart is back in Lambo land. It's glorious. We're above the tuner moving average. We found support there last night, as you can see, moved off it. We are above it. We have support above it. We're cruising all green candles on the, uh, all green EMAs basically on the, uh, uh, Madrid ribbons here. Now look at this. Uh, directional index is green. ADX is beautiful. Uh, RSI is pumping up. KRI is looking amazing. And Lazy Bear White Wave Trend Oscillator is up top. We are good to go. So with that said, it's just a damn glorious day. Check out the two-hour chart. Fire up a fib. Look where we are. Um, I myself hopped out at 39.5 on a trade 
because of that psychological issue of getting over 40k if we get above 40k find support and then start moving back up we are really blue skies until 42 easily you never know we could see an all-time high in the next couple well crap hours for bitcoin or 15 minutes for bitcoin or days but anyway regardless we had this dismal awful sad um a couple days i mean in bitcoin this is like an eternity one two three four days of red candles well now we're back in the action. This beautiful, beautiful uptrend. Shorters, I hope you made your money. It was a tough game to play, but that crap's over. Back to going long. This has been the Bitcoin Daily View. Go to BitcoinDailyView.com. Check out all the cool stuff. This is a cool interview with Crypto Love, all about love and life and happiness in the parallel economy and society that is being made, and crypto is a big part of that. I am glad you are here for the peaceful revolution, and I will see you again tomorrow. Take care.